This is my child. I mean, before I had my child, before I had my boyfriend, it was just him and I. Tonight, this woman is desperate to find her bulldog, and she thinks someone took him from her backyard. 13 Action News reporter Brian Callahan is live at Animal Control to explain what might have happened. Brian. Well, Steve, Animal Control says during heat waves like the one we're experiencing right now, they typically see a spike in calls from neighbors concerned about dogs left outside. We're told most are unfounded, but Maribel Diaz says she thinks a concerned neighbor skipped the call and took matters into their own hands. Perry, say cheese. And I saw a picture of Perry and I fell in love with him. He was just this teddy bear, all white, big paws looking thing. Maribel Diaz has signs up all over her neighborhood, hoping someone knows where her dog is. When I came home, my gate was completely open. Diaz is confident someone took her bulldog because he was left in the backyard while she was at work. He is now eight years old. He never has liked a doggy door. She says animal control has been to her house twice to investigate complaints and found no issues. She thinks someone is trying to teach her a lesson. It's been four days and nothing. I have no letter. I have no anything just because somebody feels I'm inadequate. She says if someone has a problem, she can show them how she keeps Perry cool outside, including a custom built doghouse, water dishes, sleds turned into dog pools, and even a gazebo with misters. The sun is here or it's not here. He comes here, you can see the hair everywhere. He puts his pillows where he wants them. Being an eight year old bulldog, Diaz says Perry needs medications but she's worried about how he's doing without them and his special treatment he gets from the family. I'm his mom. I know what he needs and he is somewhere that I have no idea where he's at. Now Diaz has filed a police report. It shows the theft would be classified as a felony because Perry is a purebred bulldog. Diaz is offering a reward if he is returned. Reporting live, Brian Callahan, 13 Action News. Thank you, Brian. While not everyone agrees with leaving pets outside in the heat, Clark County Animal Control says when the National Weather Service issues a heat advisory, animals do need supplemental cooling. Also, when the temperature outside is above 85 degrees, they must have enough shade to protect themselves from direct sunlight.